How to find a job? One. I was wondering if you could help me use the student job center. There are many ways. What kind of job would you like? Hmm, I want to work in a restaurant. Fine. Will you need part time or full time work? I want to work part time. Fine. The two best ways are to use our local listing binders over there, or you can use the computers with the internet job listing sites. See them over there. Yes, I know what to do. Well, in addition, you can schedule an appointment with the job counselor on this list. If you would like to do that, sign here, okay? Yes, I think that would be great. Fine. Well, the job search tools are all here for you to use. Feel free to look around and use what works best for you. Have fun with it. How to find a job? Two. Could you help me figure out how to look for a job? We have lots of options. What type of job do you need? I want to work in an office. Do you want to work part time or full time? Oh, I want to work full time. We have binders with local job listings, or you can make use of the computers. Okay? I am confused a bit, but I'm sure that I can figure it out. If you make an appointment with a job counselor, they can also provide you with a lot of information. Do you want to see a counselor? No, I don't think I need to do that. Well, you know that this job center is here for your use, so help yourself. Good luck. How to find a job? Three. What is the best way to find a job here? There are different ways of conducting a job search. Do you know what you want to do? I don't know. Can you work part time or full time? It doesn't matter right now. Either one would be okay. The binders have current local jobs listings, and the computer jobs lists are good too. Understand? Okay, I'll go check it out. Schedule an appointment with a counselor, and you can get more information. Would that work for you? I am not sure. Everything that you need for a successful job search is here. Happy job searching! Greeting by receptionist one. Hi, I'm here for my job interview. Fine, have a seat. May I get you some water or coffee? Sure, thank you. I'll get that for you right now.、Uh, thank you. What a nice office this is. Yes, could you come in now? I'm going to take you back to meet your interviewer, Mr. Gotcha. Greeting by receptionist two. Hello, I have an appointment for an interview today. Great, have a seat. Would you like some tea or coffee? I'd love some. The coffee area is right over there. Please help yourself. Thank you. What a beautiful view from this office. Yes. Oh, here comes Mr. Gotcha now. I'll show you to his office. Greeting by receptionist three. Good morning. I have an interview scheduled this morning. The interviewer will be with you in one moment. Would you care for some water? Yes, that would be great. Just help yourself to whatever you would like from the table in the waiting area. Thank you. This is a very lovely office building. Yes. Why don't you come straight through the door and we'll walk down to Mr. Gatcha's office together. Asking questions at an interview. One. May I ask you how much this position pays per year? This job pays sixty-five thousand dollars per year. What kind of benefits does this job have? This job provides full medical, dental, and disability. What type of vacation time do we get? You get three weeks paid vacation that you may use as you wish. Do we have a four hundred one k? We offer a four hundred one k with some matching funds available depending on length of service. What type of professional development do you offer? We provide up to date training on state of the art equipment. Where do I sign up for my benefits package? Down the hall. I'll show you when the interview is over. Asking questions at an interview. Two. What is the annual salary for this job? 
The annual salary is sixty-five thousand dollars per year. What does the benefits package include? This job pays for half of your medical, dental, and disability. Do we get paid time off? You have a total of twenty-one days paid time off, which could be used for vacation, personal, or sick leave. How about retirement? We still offer a traditional retirement plan that pays out if you stay with the company for five years or more. Can I get company-provided specialized training? We offer full tuition reimbursement for job-related classes. Where's the benefits office? It's on the second floor, it's suite two zero one. Asking questions at an interview three. What will I earn per year in this job? You can expect to earn sixty-five thousand dollars per year. Are we covered by a good benefits plan? The job has a menu plan where you are given a fixed amount of money, and you choose what you most need in terms of benefits. Can we take personal days off? You get two weeks paid vacation and an additional ten days of sick leave. What do you offer in terms of a retirement plan? We do not currently offer any retirement plan. Do you reimburse for education that relates to my job? We allow several weeks release time each year for our employees to attend job-related seminars and conferences. Do you have a benefits brochure? Whoa! Who said you got this job? Preparing for a job interview. One. Hey, could you help me try and figure out how to get ready for my job interview? The most important thing to do is to make sure you know the company and what services or products it provides. Do you know all about them? Yes, I'm pretty much understanding the company. Well, after you've done your research, you have to decide whether the company is casual or formal. Have you decided what they are yet? Yes, I've been observing them. When you are choosing what to wear, keep all of that in mind. Have you chosen what to wear? I already have something to wear. I would always be ready to go shopping with you. Should we talk about other basics? Okay, I'm ready to think of other things. You need to make sure you arrive on time. Smile. Be pleasant and friendly. Look the person in the eye and answer all questions to the best of your ability. You'll do great. Preparing for a job interview two. I'm not sure what to do to get ready for my job interview. Make sure that you understand the company. Do you understand what it is that they do? No, I probably need to do some more research. When you finish your research, it will help you figure out whether your company is rigid in philosophy or kind of more relaxed. Does that make sense? I think that their attitude is rather casual. So all that information will help you to pick out what to wear. Do you have something to wear? I have absolutely nothing so far. You know, I could go shopping with you sometime if you need it. But can we talk about other basics? Yeah, where should we go from here? Focus on being relaxed and open. Don't forget to smile and shake hands, and be genuinely interested in what their company is about. I'm sure you'll do well. Preparing for a job interview three. What should I do to prepare for a job interview? An understanding of the basic workings of a company and the services or goods it provides is essential. Do you have that? Sort of, but I could know more, I guess. With that understanding, you can figure out what your company is looking for in terms of basic attitude, right? I think that they are a very formal company. What you wear is important, so keep in mind what is suitable for the company and type of work you will be doing. Need help? I need a lot of help in this area. In addition to clothes, we need to think about other basics. Okay? Yes. What else should we think of? Be prompt. Don't forget to be friendly and interested. Listen carefully and listen to what they are really asking you. You'll be a hit. Accepting a job offer. One. Hello. Is this Mr. Wallace? 
Yes, this is Mr. Wallace. Mr. Wallace, this is the Xenon Company. Oh, hello. How are you doing? Mr. Wallace, we are very pleased with your interview and would like to offer you the position. Wonderful. I'm very happy to be able to join your organization. We are interested in having you begin as soon as possible, perhaps in two weeks? Yes, that would be perfect. Okay, then. We will see you then. Accepting a job offer, too. Good morning. May I speak with Mr. Wallace, please? You're speaking to him. May I help you? Hello, Mr. Wallace. This is the Xenon Company calling to speak with you. Yes, good to hear from you. We are calling you today to offer you the job you interviewed for last week. That's great. I'm looking forward to working for you. Would you be able to begin working for us in two weeks? I could begin working then with no problem. Welcome to our company. We will see you then. Accepting a job offer, three. This is Joanne Brack calling. Is Mr. Wallace in? Yes, how may I help you? I'm calling you from the Xenon Company. Yes, I was hoping to hear from you. You had a great interview, and we are pleased to be able to offer you a position. Oh, excellent. I will consider it an honor to join your organization. Would two weeks from now be a good start date for you? That would be great. I could give notice to my current job and start with you on that date. Glad that will work for both of us. I look forward to seeing you then. Job interview, one, one. Good morning. I am here for my interview. Hello. Nice to meet you. I'm Mr. Gotcha. Have any trouble finding place? No problem. So, why don't you tell me why you are interested in changing positions? Unfortunately, our company is shutting down due to the economy. What would you consider your strengths? I am probably best at researching for marketing purposes. What is your biggest weakness? I tend to get bored easily and so love to keep myself challenged. We have a position where that could work out well. Job interview, one, two. Hello, thank you for taking the time to interview me. Hi there, I'm Bill Gotcha, the owner of Gotcha Enterprises. Did you find your way here okay? Your assistant gave wonderful directions. Why are you switching jobs at this point in your career? Our company is moving overseas, and I wish to stay in the United States. What are you best at? I am good at organizing systems that have been having problems. What is your biggest challenge in terms of skills? I don't like to sit around and so like to always find things to do to keep myself busy. That is good to hear. Job interview, one, three. Good afternoon. Thank you for the opportunity to interview for this position. Hello. Have a seat. I'm Bill Gotcha. I am assuming you found your way here with no trouble? Actually, I am very familiar with the area, so there was absolutely no problem. I am curious as to why you want to leave your current employer. I am interested in switching fields. Do you feel that you are exceptionally good at anything in particular? I am good at pulling together teams of people to accomplish a task. What are you not good at? I am impatient with myself at times and am hard on myself. We appreciate hearing that about you. Job interview, two, one. Good morning. Thank you for the interview. No problem. Now, do you prefer working with others or flying solo? Actually, I enjoy both. So, what is most important to you in a job? Do you need job security or professional growth and a chance to advance? I need job security. Would you be able to relocate? I am open to relocating. What are your annual salary requirements? I need at least $75,000 per year. I'll keep that in mind. Thank you for coming in today. We'll be in touch. Job interview, two, two. 
Thank you so much for interviewing me this evening. Happy to meet with you. Now, do you prefer group projects? I like to work alone on some things and then bring those things to the group. Do you value a steady job more or one that offers a chance to move ahead? I want to grow in my job and move ahead. Could you work for us in another state if need be? I need to stay in the area because of my family. How much do you need to make per year? 75000 per year. Yikes! Thanks for your interest in this job. We'll be getting back to you. Job interview, two, three. Hello! I really appreciate the opportunity to interview for this position. I was wondering if you like team projects or projects that you work on alone. I like to work on group projects that value and need each individual's contributions. Are you most interested in a good steady job with benefits or one that will allow you to quickly advance? Hmm, I have children, so a steady job is important, but I would like a chance to advance. How would you feel about relocating to another state? I could not relocate in the next year, but might be open to it in the future. Do you know how much this job offers per year? A minimum of 75000 per year. Okay, well, that's all I need to know for now. If something comes up, we'll be contacting you. Asking for help, one. Can you help me plan the office party? Sure. What do you need the most help with, the food or the entertainment? I need help with food. Okay. Well, let's coordinate our efforts. Should this party be formal or casual? I think it should be casual. I agree. Next, we have to decide on food. We have a choice of Chinese or continental cuisine. Which one should we have? I would prefer Chinese food for this party. Perfect choice. For music, should we have a live band or a DJ? I think we should hire a live band. Okay, then. Well, I will work on my part and get back to you with my progress on Friday. Asking for help, too. I need help with the office party. Yes, of course. We could split it. What part would you like to do, the food or the entertainment? I have no idea what the entertainment should be. Let's make sure we are on the same page. Do we want a formal or informal gathering? Let's make it a formal affair. Yes, that would be best. Now for food, should we have Chinese or American food? American food would be the best choice. That would be great. What kind of music would you like, a band or recorded music? We should bring in a really good DJ. That would work for me. Let's see what we can each do about planning our part and meet again on Friday. Asking for help, three. Would you help me figure out what to do about the office party? I would be happy to help. What would you like me to help you with, food or entertainment? I would like to help you with both. That will work out fine. To make sure everything goes together, do you think this party should be casual or dressy? A dressy party would be fun. That will work out fine. Do you think that Chinese or continental food would be best? We should probably have both. Yes, that will work out fine. Should we hire a band or bring in a DJ? Maybe we could do both. Everything sounds great then. I'll meet you back here on Friday to discuss the details. Making a request for office supplies, one. Excuse me, I was wondering how to order office supplies. We have a requisition form on the company website. What type of supplies do you need? I need paper, ink, cartridges, and paper clips. How quickly will you need your supplies? I need all my supplies right away. We also will have to check your department budget. Do you know how much money you have for office supplies? I will check to see what my budget is. Would you like these supplies delivered or would you like to pick them up? Please deliver them to my office. Fine. Well, just send the form to us and we will let you know as soon as your supplies come in. 
Have a good day. Thank you. Making a request for office supplies to. I need help in ordering my office supplies. Uh, yeah, you can print out a copy of the order supply form from our company website and turn it into me. What will you be needing? I need ink cartridges, staples, and post-it. Will you need all of them right away, or can some wait? Some of these can wait, but there are a few things that I need right away. You can only buy supplies that you have a budget for. Do you know what your budget is? We have plenty of money for office supplies. You can pick these supplies up, or they can be delivered to your building. Which would you prefer? I want to pick them up. Well, just finish the request, and we will contact you when the supplies come in. Have a good day. You too. Making a request for office supplies. Three. How do I order the office supplies that I need? Fill out this form with whatever you need. What do you need the most? I need many things. I can get a few of them right away, but might have to order some. I can wait a few days for these items. Make sure that you have money allocated for these supplies. How much do you have for office supplies? I don't think we have very much money for supplies, but we have a little. Would you like them delivered to you, or can you come get them here? I am not sure yet. When you finish completing the request form, we will order and let you know when the supplies are here. Have a great day. Goodbye. Talking on the phone. One. Hello, this is Ray. May I speak with Lee? Yes, this is Lee speaking. Hi, Lee. How are you today? Oh, things are going great. What's up? I was wondering if you could meet me tomorrow for lunch. Sure. Where did you have in mind? I was thinking of Joe's in the Village. I love that place. Sure, let's go there. Fine then. I'll meet you around twelve. I'll see you there. Look forward to it. Talking on the phone too. Good morning. This is Ray speaking. Is Lee in? Hi, Ray. This is Lee. Good morning, Lee. How is it going with you today? Things are wonderful. What can I help you with? Can we meet for lunch tomorrow to discuss the new project? That would be great. What restaurant did you have in mind? We could go to Lozano's downtown. That would be perfect. It's a nice, quiet place to meet. I'll see you then around twelve. Then. I am looking forward to meeting with you. See you then. Talking on the phone. Three. Hi. May I speak with Lee? This is Ray. Lee here. Lee, I thought that was you. How's it going? I'm doing well. How can I help you? I would like to treat you to lunch tomorrow, so I can get some suggestions from you. Sounds like a plan. Where would you like to meet? How about the new Chinese place next door? Yes, that would work well for me. Okay, I'll join you around twelve for lunch then. It's a go then. See you there. How to do a timesheet one? Can you help me with my timesheet? Sure, I can help you. Do you know where the timesheets are kept? No, I don't know where to find one. Well, once you get one off the shelf over there, you first put your name on it, okay? Yes, I can do that. Now you have to fill in the hours in the blanks and total the hours for the week. Do you know how to use military time? No, I don't know what that is. Okay, so we just start counting hours at midnight and record it. Show all minutes as a dot and then write down how many minutes. Okay? Yes, I understand to do this. After your total hours, you make sure you sign it and turn it into your supervisor. That was easy. Good luck and let me know if you need any help later on. How to do a timesheet too? How do we do timesheets here? They are actually fairly straightforward. Do you know where the blanks are kept? Yes, I already have one. Okay. Well, after you take one out of that second drawer, you put your name on the top. Do you see? I am kind of confused. Next, you fill in all of your hours for each day and total them. Do you know how to show time on a twenty-four hour clock? 
I'm not quite sure. Midnight is zero, and when you put the minute in, make sure that you show them with a dot followed by the minutes. Do you understand? No, I have no idea what you're talking about. It's easy. Just write in the hours, total it, sign it, and put it in the box. Thanks for your help. Try it, and if you can't do it, one of us always can help you later. How to do a timesheet three. I need help with my timesheet. Okay, no problem. Have you found the blank ones? Yes, I have seen them. Yes, well, put your name on it after you've downloaded it off of the company website. Okay? Yes, I understand what to do. You fill in the hours and then total them for the week. Have you ever used a twenty-four hour clock? What? Huh? So after you noted the hours starting at zero, which is midnight, just write down the minutes as a dot followed by minutes. Get it? Huh? What? Just make sure you show your total, sign it, and turn it in. I thought you said this was easy. You are a quick learner. I don't think you'll have any trouble with this. Offering help one. I was wondering if you needed any help on your new project. Sure, that would be great. Are you good at writing, or would you rather do the computer work? I'd like to help with the computer work. Great, we're going to be working in teams of three. Are you okay working with others? Yes, I like working like that. We will begin next Monday. Would you be available then? Yes, I can be there. Well, if you could send me your basic background information before next Monday, it would be very useful. Okay, I will send the information to you. Well then, thanks for your help. Have a great day. Offering help too. Would you like me to help you on your new project? I would love the help. Would you prefer helping with the writing part, or is programming more your thing? I would enjoy helping with the writing portion. Perfect. You'll be working alone on that portion. Do you like to work alone? That is okay sometimes. Our first meeting is next Monday. Could you meet with us at that time? No, I can't be there. Please send me your background information before the meeting so I can look at it. I can send that information to you. Okay. I look forward to working with you. Enjoy your week. Offering help three. Could I help you on your new project? I have a need for help with writing, and also a need for help with the computer work. Which would you prefer? I want to help with both. That would be wonderful. Sometimes we will be working together, and sometimes independently. Would that be okay? Most of the time, that is what I prefer. We start on Monday. Can you be there? I am not sure yet. I need your background information before the meeting. I will do that. I'll enjoy working with you. Have a great day.